What is up guys? This is Zach with Dream Media Home Theater and I am back on this project that you guys loved. Remember this room where we have all this ambient light? Yeah, not really ideal for a theater room, but today I'm back on the final installation putting in the Lutron roller shades and these are knockouts. So it's going to kind of help with some of the ambient light that we have in this space. Let me show you what we got here, guys. Lutron shades. And these are gonna go here, as well as here, here, and here. And then the customer is going to be getting a door to go here. Now shades isn't our primary business, guys, but it is an add-on that a lot of customers request from us. We are a Lutron as well as SI dealer, Screen Innovations. Um, so if you need shades, let us know. Nationwide free shipping and a low price guarantee. These are custom order though, guys, so you gotta be very precise with exactly what you want. Um, but I'll show you what it looks like when we get these up here and uh, give you guys an idea of something you may wanna do in your own home. Thanks for watching. Getting these shades up. I got two of them up now. They're looking super clean. Check it out, guys. I just love the, the finish of these guys. Give you a really nice, clean, modern look. And they come in so many different color options, fabric options, um, design options. Lutron really is one of the leaders in shades. Um, so if you guys are wanting automated shades this is definitely a very good option i don't use them all the time but when i do use them they work they work well um, lutron delivers a quality product every time which is what we're looking for something that will last for the customer um, i'm gonna pop these other two up and then i'll show you what it looks like All right, guys, I got all four mounted up on the wall. Everything's looking really good. I really love how clean these shades are. They go really well in between the opening there. And look very seamless and clean. Clean, clean, clean. Um, anyways, so now that all of the shades are installed, we're gonna move on to the programming, which is super easy. So basically, you just open up the Lutron app, which we are also doing Lutron lights in this particular room. So it integrates into the customer's universal remote. And he gave me his login to his account, so I'm gonna do it for him. You can see it gives you different options here. All of the different things that Lutron has to offer. We're basically gonna to go to shades or drapery and then you actually just hold down this one button for 10 seconds and you're done. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that. The green light will start to pulse quickly, letting you know that it's transmitting a signal. And then we're gonna go in and we're gonna select what room. This is the media room. Next, I'm gonna call this Shade number two. Basically, I'm just working my way around. It's gonna add it into the system, and then it's like, okay, well, do you wanna add any more devices? And literally, all you have to do is say yes. Hold down another button, and after you get them all programmed into the system, then you can come in and adjust how low you want it to drop, um, and then create automated scenes if that's something you're interested in. Um, but I'm gonna get all these in the system updated, and then I'll show you what it looks like in action. All right guys, so the next thing that we're going to do is just set our limits for how low and high the shades go. They're not bad out of the box because obviously we custom ordered these to these windows, so they're gonna be close. But you see how like over here on this particular shade and on this shade back here, how at the bottom they're kind of like crinkled up right there. 
well, you can come in to shade whatever uh, you called it. In this situation, I just went one through four in the media room. And you go to close limit. And what I can do is just give it a little, little bump to where it's just perfectly lining up right there at the bottom like the other ones, and then I save that. So the next time it closes, it'll close right to that exact millimeter um, and look super clean and, and custom. Then all you do is just save it. I mean, this app is extremely intuitive, and you can do that on the open too in case it's not rolling up far enough. One of the, the coolest little features. So I'm gonna go into shade four, same thing. I'll give you like a close up on this one. Close limit. See how it's all crinkled up? Doesn't look that good. I'm gonna just go up, couple clicks. Now it looks like we're right there at the bottom, which is what I like. And I'm gonna save that. I'm gonna do the same thing over here on this one, shade number one. Edit, limit, close limit, up just a hair. Perfect. And we're going to save it. You can see now it's pretty much perfect there at the bottom. So now what I'm going to do is go ahead and put them all up and just see how far they close. And you can create um, scenes as well to where they all go up or they all go down all at once. But shades are awesome because you get the best of both worlds. You get this beautiful backdrop. And then whenever you want, you can come in and just close it and watch a movie. So I'm gonna show you now how to do a group. Or you can, or a scene is what they call it. So, we'll aim me over here so you can see a couple of them in action. We're going to go to scene, add a scene. And we'll call this, do a little sun. And we'll call this shades up. Shades up. And then we're going to add in. The shade open, the shade open, the shade open, and the shade open. And that scene's added. And then I'm gonna create one that is called nighttime. Shade, shade's closed. And I'm just going to go closed, 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 closed. So now I can go to my scenes and there's also schedules. You can have it go up and down during certain times of the day to save on energy, which is nice. Now, one thing I just noticed, guys, is see how that shade right there and this one over here, they're not all the way up. I need to adjust my limit real quick. So I'm gonna go to shade number two, edit, shade limit, open limit. And I'm gonna just bump it up a little. I want it to look real clean for the customer. Save. Okay, shade number four, same thing, set limit. Set the limit. That way it's completely up in there. Now that all my settings are made, I can test out a scene. So let's do shades close. Look at that. We have action. Pretty cool. 
and they all sync up too so they go up and down at the same time at the same rate so it gives a really high-end finish I forget what it is that Lutron calls that but it's something proprietary it's that they have that some of the other manufacturers don't have so uh, the details you know and then we'll go back up And now we have light. Another little thing that we did, guys, it's kind of cool is see how um, I have main lights and accent lights. I can turn off the accent lights, which are the lights in the front here, and still have on these rear lights at the back of the room. So like if the customer is watching a football game or something and they want to have some popcorn, they can just dim down these back ones like that. They can leave the accents off the front lights and then they can come in and close all their shades and then watch how nice it is in here. Like I said, this they're going to put a door right here that's being custom made, but pretty cool little theater. I mean, considering the space, I think it's, uh, it's a pretty cool setup. Not like a it was built for a theater room, but... We made it into one. <laughs> so you can see with these lights on at the back, it's it's really nice and lit up back here, but where our screen is, it's pitch dark, which is gonna give us a really nice picture, especially once this is closed up. But everything with time, nothing good comes easy, as they say. Um, that's the... The operation of the Lutron system. Now, another cool thing is that this will integrate into its universal remote. Let me see where that is. It's over here. We're using the Harmony Pro. So basically, I'm going to go into the Harmony app and I'm going to add in those shades to the system so that the customer under devices, not only will they have all these listed and the lights, you can see the lights. But they'll also have their shades, which will automatically load in from the Lutron app. Cool little smart theater. I'm happy with how everything turned out. I got some more configurations here that I'm going to be working on. Just to optimize the system for the customer. But this kind of gives you an idea of things that our company is capable of. And does on a daily basis if you guys would like us to do something like this for you and you live in dallas just give me a call or shoot me a text or email and we'd love to earn your business now if you guys do not live in dallas like a lot of my customers make sure you give me a call or an email because we do have nationwide free shipping on all products and a low price guarantee so we're going to give you that five star service even from across the nation if you guys have questions, just let me know. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up and subscribe down below. This is Zach with Dream Media Home Theater. Thank you for watching.